Hey everyone, Earl here. Uh, today I have the 124th uh, Saitama and 1974 Mazda RX-3 uh, from Jada. I don't usually buy a 124th, but uh, I'm a big fan of One Punch Man, and I saw this at Target and picked it up. I'm probably going to keep this find this in the box. I'm going to try to open this very carefully. Uh, we'll see if we can do that. If I don't, I guess we'll uh, we'll not display it in the box. But here's the side. Uh, nice picture of Saitama. Uh, and then the back is uh, Saitama in the car. And this side just has the uh, One Punch Man fist. And that was the front we saw before. Um, I don't know if you guys like the show. I like the show. I thought it was, it was pretty cool. I'm gonna try open it from this side. Is there tape on? Uh, looks like just the one piece. Of, oh no, on this side. There we go. Let's see if we can open this up without damaging it too much. Here. Oh, there's some more tape there. I was hoping that this base would just slide out. Will we, will we be lucky like that? Oh, you know what? We will be. Pretty nice. There we go. And now we have the car on the plastic base. Let's see here. Oh, we got some screws. Alright, so we got a screwdriver. I'm going to take out these screws here. Yeah, um... If you don't know the story, he was a office guy looking for a job and couldn't find one. And he started working out and uh, he ended up becoming super strong. And now he's got to fight all the uh, bad guys because he joined the heroes. So a job as a hero. Oh, I'm dropping everything here. And it looks like um, Saitama screwed on there too, so we're gonna. Oh no, that's that screwed up. Oh, let's see. Yeah, that's screwed on there. Okay. I'm just gonna unscrew it off camera here.
they screwed Saitama back onto the to the base. Um, looks like it's he's a die cast figure, so he is metal. He's not posable. Uh, and it does look like there's some looks like he got some knocks around here. On his uh, right below his right knee. But other than that it's pretty uh the cape is plastic, but I believe the body figure is die cast. Um, didn't expect that, thought it'd be plastic. Um, as for the car, let's see, we do have some uh, plastic uh, keeping the doors and the hood closed. Hard rubber wheels, um, four uh, four spoke look pretty nice. Um, I like the graphics on here. I think that's pretty cool. I uh, got one punch man on the hood, and the reverse graphics are the same. Now let's see if these the doors do open up. Here's a look inside. Right hand drive because uh, I guess it's uh, a JDM model there's the inside and this one Let's see if I can get a good focus in the back no back oh, yeah very there's back seats back there and let's see if this hood opens up The hood is very tight. I don't want to scratch it. There we go. Got the hood. Not really any detailing on the hood. And under the hood, rather. Uh, there's an engine in there, but not painted at all. I think they missed an opportunity with that. Uh, not painting the hood. I don't think the trunk opens up. Oh yeah, it does. The trunk does open up. Not much going on in there though. Very small. Uh, plastic tail lights. But I think they did a good job there. One punch man on the license plate. And there's the back. The bottom, sorry. So, uh, in conclusion, um, I think it's a nice set. Um, if you're a big uh, One Punch Man fan, I would pick it up. Um, just for the die cast itself, uh, it's nice. Um, I do like the design. I felt like uh, could get a little more details, like a painted engine. Um, but overall, I think it's pretty nice. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.